Hello guys, welcome back, episode 8, Milk It. Last episode, level 7, was my biggest nightmare so far. It took me so long um, to actually get it, to beat it. And Milk It, well, I already attempted once to beat it, and yeah, it seems like this is going to be also a pretty challenging game, and I think they're all challenging, they're going to be from now on. But this is also the level where I got stuck as a kid and I never actually beat it past level 8. I remember this specifically. Well, actually, it might have been 7 and 8. I don't... Uh, no, no, it, it's been level 8. Yeah, I remember this. I remember the layout. And I know it's a small map too. So, yeah. Lotto is a new exclusive resort specifically aimed at wealthier guests. You can't cut corners as you develop it because only the best will do. Though, if you get it right, these guests will part with their money very easily. You've got 10 days to try and generate 30,000 income in any one day. So yeah, um, <laughs> that is quite of a challenge. Well then, this this level is actually tricky because, uh, well, <laughs> I have to say, once again, I spent quite some time replaying this over and over until I pretty much realized what I have to do. Um, it is a pretty tricky level because it is, um, how should I say it? It's really like the, the first first few hours or the first day, I guess I should say. Yeah, the first day is the most important. Like if you don't do, if you don't build the right buildings on the first day, um, you're going to lose because everyone's gonna start leaving and you're not gonna be able to attract more people because you won't have any money and you know like it's gonna be a loop also this map is one of those maps or I guess like it is the map where uh, people are willing to spend the money which means you can raise the prices a little bit especially for your um, the main living block um, but you still kind of have to know what buildings you should build um, at the beginning because wrong selection of buildings could cost you the game. So basically what I, what I build is the lifeguard tower to unlock some other buildings. We build some food or I mean beer, beer stall. We, we make the um, soft drinks stall. Um, what else did we make at the very beginning? I guess now we have to wait for these guys to build a little bit. Also, you need to make sure that your buildings are maintained because these thunders will damage them. But yeah, let's wait for these buildings to be built. So what you need to do in this level, you have to raise the security level to four stars and make 30,000 30, in one day. So, yeah, I mean, wait, what am I doing? No, 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 no. I wanted to raise the price, but instead I was kind of messing with the strength of the drink. Um, yeah, let's make everything for hours inspection. Okay, so now we unlocked some stuff. Let's put the disco so that people, so that there is some nightlife. That's actually your biggest biggest money maker in this level. Nighttime activities. That's gonna be the biggest boost. We need to make some money. Uh, food, I mean, food stuff. Um, cleaner shack, so that it unlocks the, um, uh, what is it called? Um, arcade, yes, arcade. So, it would be nice if I could, well, I do have money for an arcade and also the pedalo higher because we will need to unlock some jet skis and stuff you know those are the big money makers basically but yeah you can pretty much raise the prices of everything piece by piece oh almost forgot the toilet toilet is kind of important too Shower is going to be a little bit more expensive. But yeah, like people are willing to spend money on this level. Oh, and I forgot one more thing. You need to make sure uh, trash doesn't pile up because that also affects people's um, 
opinion about the level, I guess. Also, let's make these guys work, well, a little bit longer because we do need more buildings to be built. You know, the first day is the most important day. It's the day when you either build enough stuff to keep people busy or you don't and they start leaving. That's why you need to make sure your workers are working um, quite some time. Okay. Don't want to like spread my workers way too much though. 13k. We still have money for one more thing. Pedalo higher. I just want to make sure they build the other stuff. Okay, good. Okay, and then we build Pedalo higher to unlock some more stuff. And 7k. Okay, we still have 7k. That's good. Let me double check if I built everything. Well, I mean, you could build... Oh, yes. Water plant. You need that because the water is um, poor water supply. It kind, I think it also affects um, if people stay or leave. Let's make them work a little bit longer. I still need them to build... A couple more things we're actually in the minus now everyone's vomiting too and I forgot the um, yeah I forgot the trash trash cans I forgot to place them everywhere because you need them if you want to maintain cleanliness to some degree yeah just like it's never too much. You want to make sure you know that your cleaners don't have to clean up too much. But okay, we got the cleaning thing. Okay, I think we build everything, most of it at least, that we need for the first day. Um, next thing should be the pool to unlock some other cool stuff. But we won't make money in this anymore the night is over yeah you see the amount of people leaving that's that's really scary because that they do that like they don't like something boom that's it you're done game over pretty much you just you just need that first boost basically that that first day boost or first two days boost to make sure that people are not leaving if people are not leaving, you should be fine. Okay, we don't have any workers. They're pretty happy though. That's nice. So let's say they are gonna they're gonna start working at thirteen. No, oh, actually. Let's make it so that there's always someone working, or almost, at least almost, always. Okay, the pool takes forever to build, too. Okay, 90 people, I think we might have, might have successfully secured the fact that people are not going to leave. But it's too early to say. Oh, we need... Oh, yeah, we need power now. We need power. So next up, power station. Power station, and then we pretty much build up the infrastructure. Uh-oh. It dropped to 56 people. Oof, okay. Well, we it might be a GG. Okay, but we'll see, we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully not, though. And there's still a lot of trash everywhere. Maybe I need some... I don't know. Some beautiful things so people like it a little bit more. 
I'm not sure how this affects it. I, I sometimes make sure I build these, but I don't always remember to. But yeah, let's see. Let's see if we actually succeeded or failed. Can we make 5k even? Probably not. Like before everyone goes to bed, like basically that's when you make your money. Like right before midnight, but I'm not making money right now. Oh no, 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 after midnight. Yes, after midnight, sorry. So before like 3 or 4 a.m., usually like it's a big money boost. See, like the money started going up, but it kind of stopped. So I think I'm, hmm. Okay, now it's going up again. Can we make 5k though? That's the question. Come on, come on. There we go. 5k. Yeah, the amount of people we have though is a little bit low. That's a little bit worrying. But hopefully, um, hopefully we built enough stuff, you know, for people to, um, oh yeah, the bar. We need the bar. Bar at the pool bar. And maybe I should make some beauty stuff around. Well, mainly fountains. I don't have the money though. Okay, so we made 13k in the, in the day basically. Well, in the morning. So like you see, it's the money maker. Like everything till like eight or something is the biggest biggest money maker that you have and then during the day well i guess you can build up uh, slowly once you secure that amount of people that they don't leave completely you can build up stuff you know although there's not too much stuff to build here because there's not much space but this is why you need the water stuff because you know this is the daytime activities basically like, you can't really pull, uh, put big pools here. There's not enough space. But yeah, this, this is the level where I was struggling quite a bit. It took me quite, quite a few tries to understand what I need to do. And once again, the walkthrough guides online are not that helpful because they say that you have to build two security guard posts right away almost right to like increase your security which is not the case you don't have to worry about the security at the very beginning you need to secure the activities that's the first thing you need to make sure that you know because if you don't have activities people will leave and they won't come back so once you secure the activities then you can focus on the star, but you can, as you can see, like it's still, it kind of goes up even without the guards. And I think I've seen it at four, even uh, four stars without even having a security guard, one security guard. So, yeah. So now we need to make money so we could put some more activities. Um, restaurant would be nice, but I think I'm going to go with Jacuzzi because it's one of the cheaper activities. I just need to have a variety of activities, basically. Ooh, 6k, nice, nice, nice. Then we can build uh, windsurfing. That's gonna be a daytime activity, although it doesn't seem like there's too many people who go for those during the day. I probably should have saved up for a restaurant because nighttime is the biggest money maker. But I don't know. I guess you you do kind of need to uh, to um, spread your services a little bit, right? Make sure there's a little bit of everything. Let's uh, I don't know build some some scenery so that. You know, it adds to the attractiveness of our resort. Oh, you know what? What else we need? What we really need is uh, another apartment block. Oh, 
or whatever you call it. <clears throat> Okay, so we have this, and we got this. Also make sure that your um, activities are being maintained, or your buildings are maintained, because, you know, the thunder keeps breaking your um, buildings, basically. Okay, yeah, now we need to save for another apartment block, because 89, it's gonna be always, like, around that number until you build an apartment building, or apartment block which allows you to have more than 100 and you do kind of need more people in this level so you could um, actually rack up the money you know like as you can see we, we are at 21k which is close to what we need but we're not gonna get to 30 like there's no way we can get to 30 b before midnight because you know there's just not enough activities yet so let's say for a restaurant now I think we should squeeze it in here we should be able to um, and I do want to get this jet ski uh, party boat, I mean. But we need jet ski hire first, which is 8,000. That's quite a bit. And we're on day four. We have 10 days to do it. So yeah, let, let, let's secure bigger amount of people first. Oh yeah, I forgot. I want to build this too, casino. I think I have enough space for everything. But first, you know... Let me take a selfie. No. But first, let me build a apartment block. Just need to make sure we have space in here. What is that? Oh, okay. Yeah. So yeah, this is where where the stuff happens during the night. Well, I think the biggest money maker is actually this. Like, when you increase the profit of your reception, like it bi it gives you such a big boost whenever people go go to sleep. So I guess they pay, you know, like for for the night. Every time, every night they stay and they go back inside, they they pay. So yeah, that that kind of is the big money maker, really. So the more people you have, the more money you make, basically, at the end of the day. Oh, wow, we have extra, extra, um, how much? 7k, yeah. That's pretty cool. Ah, uh, oh, there we go. Yeah, just a little bit of scenery. 8k, we have enough for a restaurant, nice. Can we squeeze it in though? We can if that trash can is removed. A restaurant. Kind of want to see though how people go and eat. You know, when I was a kid, the biggest difference between now and when I played this as a kid is that when I played this as a kid, as a kid, I would always like play in the slow speed. I never really played this game on like fast speed so I do kind of miss you know like enjoying the game a little bit the gameplay whatever you call it but you know like if you're going for for unlocking next levels and you don't want to do a sandbox then I would say you know just speed it up oh we forgot this our money maker look we're at 22k Okay, so we're close, but we're not there yet. We still need more activities, or I guess we need to attract more people. We need to attract more people. So that, you know, there will be more people spending money. No one's building this. Okay, they should be able to build it before night time, though. 23k okay next up is gonna be security booth security guard booth and then uh, well can we squeeze in yeah we can squeeze in casino here if we can squeeze in security guard booth here but we are at four levels but I still want to unlock um, the casino
Okay, 24k. We might get to 25 before midnight, but probably not. So yeah, we're like 5, 6k short. Okay, we need 3k for the security guard. Security office. Yeah, that's what it's called. Okay, we got to 25k. Maybe 26 before the uh, end of the day. Before midnight. Maybe. Almost, almost 26. Oh, we got to 26. Okay. Now let's build this. And then gonna be, it's going to be casino. Casino is going to cost a 7.5k. And then we need to also spend another um, 8.5. So we need a lot of money. Oh, look, look. The money is growing, though. Okay, let's build a... No, actually, since it's going to be daytime, let's first... Let's build a jet ski hire. Because, you know, we want to use that opportunity. Hopefully we have workers to do this. Working till 9. Let's make it till 10. Okay, I was hoping that we could also make money for the casino, but no, nah, we're 1k short. Boom, okay. Done. Okay. More and more activities. Like, now we're, like, we have a little bit more activities for the daytime, so that's good. So now we need to make another K for the... For the casino we're on day six okay so we're we're we are a little bit well i wouldn't say we're behind the schedule but i guess let's hire some security now to secure that security level and maybe squeeze out 30k by the end of the day but not today not today we're at 25. By the end of the day, we're probably going to be at 27-ish. 28, maybe. We still need a little bit more money, uh, people, though. 114 is not, well, not the best, really. I would prefer having, like, 140 or something. Or 150, you know, like, use up the capacity of the buildings where they can uh, stay. Although our security level is dropping, even though I do have security guards. Okay, that's that's going to be a close call, you know? <laughs> Imagine if we can hit 30k, but the security level is below 4. Oof. Well, I guess that would mean we need to build another security guard desk, maybe? I don't know. Like, honestly, I'm, I'm not really sure because it seems like the safety opinion is not affected by the security guards as much. Like, it, it's affected by the whole, like, I don't know. The, I don't know. Like, really, I, I don't really know what it's affected by. Maybe, uh, well, actually, you know what would make sense? If you um, needed to build more light, you know, like when areas are lit, people feel safer. Maybe that's it. Maybe there's too many dark areas in this. Huh. Could that be it? I wonder. Oh, we're at 28k. <gasps> we're not going to make it though. It's going to be 29 by the end of the day. So we're 1k short. Oh my god, we were so close to winning. So close. Oof. Okay, hopefully by the day 8, we're gonna win. Okay. Ooh, I love this song. Like, perfect song for going to go clubbing. 
<laughs> okay, okay, okay. I don't know. Maybe my theory is right. Maybe, you know, having more lights makes people feel safer. I mean, IRL, it does, you know, matter, right? People feel safer in more lit areas. That is an actually real thing. <laughs> Okay, we have 10k. Maybe I should build another security guard post just to secure, you know, that security level if it is affected by the amount of guards you have. Hmm. The thing is, though, there's not much space to build these kind of things. Could probably squeeze it in here. Oh, there we go. See, we made 27k in 6 hours of this day already. 27k. Yeah, I think I think we might be winning this now. Don't want to jinx it though, but... It kind of seems to be heading that way. Okay, let's make it work till 19... Till... 21... 23... One and three. So pretty much all day is covered. Okay, we have 10k more extra to spare. Um, I don't know, speedboat higher. Yeah, why not? Okay, this is ready. Okay, 28.5. Okay, we should be winning this now. We're, we should be able to get it by tonight, before midnight. We have a lot of activities. We have a lot of different activities. 29, okay, yeah. We won. There's a lot of people waiting, though, to leave. But, you know, it doesn't matter. We should be winning. Any second now. Any second now. Any second now. And boom. Woohoo, congratulations. Phew, that was probably hard work. There was a lot to do. We'll encounter lightning again on other islands. Your power generators usually suffer first, so try to build more than you need to keep everything running smoothly when power is short. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, that was a challenge. Like I said, first two days are the most important ones. Make sure you build activities. And I, I feel like, um, I don't know, like nighttime is the money maker here. Like, like daytime also matters. And I think uh, daytime activities is the thing that um, helps you to get that last amount of money before the, you know, the day ends. But it could be just me. So, um, as long as you follow this build, I guess, if you're struggling with this level, like I was, um, this pretty much works. I've tried this before filming this, sorry. Before filming this, I tried this, like, two or three times, and it, like, worked like a charm. I just never, like, went ahead to, like, finish the level because I wanted to do it on, on, on you know, on, on this video. But, yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next video, and, uh, yeah, take care.